I remember spending a summer with the black students, but I remember when they took over, black students took over the building. I didn't go because I wasn't black, you know, and, and so I was involved in the SDS part, but the problem with SDS is we were mostly white students, and like, I, I didn't feel at home there either. I was ready for something different. Sing a song for ourselves. What have we got to lose? Sing a song for ourselves. We got the right to choose. Even before I met him, Chris wrote a song called The Vietnamese Lament. For Asian Americans at that time, the Vietnam War was probably the most powerful magnet that illustrated who we were in this world and how we were treated. We saw images of people who looked like us constantly being abused and annihilated. And this is one more that you will not win. My people won't run from your M16 skin. And you can't quell something that's rising within. Go away, you soldiers of khaki and tin. He was probably under 20 when he wrote this. The thing that Chris was able to do was to quickly grasp the heart of a situation and very poetically put it together. But he also had to have a groove to it. He could play in a very soulful way that I had never heard any Asian play like that. And I know that my answer will 